Well, good afternoon, folks. This is day two of me uh, little trip over here at Morton and the Marsh. I'm at this campsite. I forgot the name of it now, but I'll put the name on description. I'm with the West Midlands DA. Uh, it's a caravan and camping club rally. So this is day two. I'm doing a bit of filming just outside now because there's nobody about, you know, because there's obviously lots of kids running around, which is no harm, but, you know, I just wanted a bit of do it privately. So this is the site. The rallies are really good to go on. They don't cost a lot. Okay, the facilities are basic, but you feel safe. You can, you know, park your motor up, the motor home up and you can even, I don't, so I'd lock it now, but you don't have to. If you didn't lock it, you ain't going to have any trouble. Um, you know, it's safe. I, I remember a few years ago, I left my phone on my table and out for the day. And it was still there when I got back. And I think very often that happens these days. But, uh, yeah, so this is the West Midlands DA. They are a friendly uh, gang. Um, so if you are looking to go on a rally, you know, join the club and... Uh, come along and get a good welcome i'm going on another public footpath walk shortly i haven't said it yet but don't forget to like and subscribe and stay safe everybody here's my motor home here and i've got my quest uh, little gazebo which i'll show you a better view of that now with quest uh, i'll zoom into the name there they do three sizes this is the medium one, which uh, let's go and have a quick look inside. Pan rain from inside. Now these awnings, they go up in 30 seconds and uh, come down in 30 seconds. They're really sturdy. Got a nice height on the roof. They're great. And so there's plenty of room in this one, as you can see, folks. I'm just going to have a sit down and have a chat. Oh, Mike and Judy were opposite. Uh, I put this up sort of in the middle of the two of us and I just said, help yourself, you know, save them messing around, do it, you know, putting anything up. So we're sort of sharing the gazebo. But there's plenty of room in here. This is, in fact, this is Mike's uh, chair. He's a bit of a moaner, Mike, is he? He'll probably say, oh, what are you doing in my chair? A bit like uh, the three bears. <laughs> anyway... He looks a bit like one of them. Sorry, Mike. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I'll show you these chairs. They're Outdoor Revolution. They're really nice. So he went, after he saw my video at Winfield's, the camping shop, if you look down the channel, you'll see I've done a little video there. It sort of sparked him to go down and have a look round, and uh, he bought two chairs. So uh, through my little video, that sort of, give Winfields a bit of a sale anyway and I think other people have been doing so I went back and bought two grills so uh, yeah so anyway on site there's um, there's another YouTuber um, I'm pretty certain it's Rob and Lynn on tour I mean I'm hopeless at names but uh, I have done a little clip I bumped well what I saw though here because they done a uh, uh, a video saying all oh, we're on the way to Morton Marsh so I went over and seen them and had a quick chit chat last night and um, done a short clip so I'll probably put that on after this so you'll know who I'm talking about so uh, yeah it's great the sunny day it's now oh, watch is fine it's 20 past 8 so I've got a public footpath uh, route um, mapped out and I'm going on that now folks so while it's quiet I'm going to walk through the camp so I might get one or two clips but as I say when I go on the motorhome rallies there's only about usually 20 30 people there and you sort of know everybody and they know you've got your camera and you go around and say hello and film them but here there's about 80 um, like it's more like with the caravans it's more families so although they probably wouldn't mind your video but you've got to respect their privacy and i'll try and do that as much as i can when i'm doing my videos on my walks if i see anybody i film them from a distance or if i'm close up i say always oh, like do you want to be in the video you know so that's how i operate 
Um, there is certain rules. If you're in the public, you can film anybody, apparently, but that's not my style, you know. So, uh, anyway, enough of me going about that. About the dating site, this girl messaged me last night. No, <laughs> that was in me dreams. Actually, telling a lie, do you know what I was dreaming about last night? I'll come a bit closer because I don't want everybody to know. Not here, but I mean on the channel. Dreaming about bluebells. I was going on walks on bluebells. What the hell was going wrong with me? It was kissing gates. Uh, now I was dreaming about bluebells. So I don't know what's going wrong, but that's another story, folks. So, uh, yeah, so I hope you uh, enjoy the videos and thumbs up to everybody. And um, uh, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe that on there i do the subscription just to the more you subscribe youtube they <clears throat> they share the videos like, to more people that's why i do it i don't do it for the money uh when you get to so many subscribers you can add adverts in i'm not sure i don't think i'll probably bother uh, with the adverts but well, i may do if his money's right but uh i don't think i will i do it even if i only had one subscriber myself i like making the videos because i like to do the editing and view them and i know wherever you are in the world australia usa <laughs> astral bank <laughs> that's where i was brought up uh, vermont you all enjoy them so uh, there is some good out of the videos anyway enough of me rattling on folks I'll show you a quick another view in this gazebo and let's get going. Follow me, folks. Follow me. So, nice to meet you anyway and happy yes, holidays. Happy holidays. Yeah, brilliant. Love the dog. He's beautiful, uh, isn't he? Yeah. That's Claude. Yeah, these are the chairs I sat on. The cushion didn't come with it, but uh, they're very comfy. 2150, Mike said, from uh, Winfield. So, uh, yeah, it's a good little uh, gazebo. You just um, clip those on, they got Velcro. They even on the windy time, but they stay on. But I think the new ones, uh, they come with like zip sides on, but these have been great, so uh, yeah. So that's it, folks. I'll just go all the way around. Why not? Uh, I've got it pegged down. I haven't pegged it, you can peg it from the uh, inside, but. That's done me. So here's my wheels, and uh, I'm going to go and get my gear on now, folks, and uh, we'll uh, over a walk. Follow. Hi, folks. This is a little, nice little sign. This is where I am. That's the entrance to it. Catch you in a sec. Yeah, it's the Camping and Caravan Club Certified Site CS. It must be uh, what it's called. So this is the entrance in. So follow me, folks. It's a rally field, folks, there. And this is the five van site. It looks like it's got the hard stand in here. There is a little toilet and your water there so uh, that's handy some big boy uh, trucks there looks a nice tool folks follow me audio cream tea here folks as it's early this is the entrance in to this campsite folks and uh, that's the steward's, uh, that's your checkpoint there to come in. At the moment you have to uh, put your money in an envelope, a clear one, with all your details. So it's all pretty Covid safe. Yeah, all good folks. And before you say anything, that's not my caravan. <laughs> It looks like one I used to have, maybe, but uh, I've got to find this uh, public footpath walk now, folks, so follow me. There's uh, Rob and Lynn on tour over there, folks. Hi, folks. Yeah, I'm just going on the walk. Uh, 
I was talking to a couple, and they're actually the landowners, and uh, had kindly said I can walk round this way. I can see some of the animals. So it's Daphne and Robin. Uh, that's the farm there. So they've got the chickens. They're going to take me to the lamb. So this is a nice little bonus. The horses are there. I'll do a little pan round. It's absolutely lovely. It was, uh, I say there's one thing when you go away, when you're out, you meet different people and uh, it's all part of, uh, you know, it's just great, you know, they're so friendly. Anyway, follow me. So they're just here to finish their lunch. Yeah, okay, any room for me to move in? <laughs> any room for me in the field? <laughs> anyway, these are two retired horses. That's a retired race horse and that's a retired... Uh, Hunter, so there's a. Uh, I'm gonna follow Daphne now. She's gonna, uh, I forgot the name, right? I think it's Daphne. So, following her, uh, so the sheep folks follow me. Yeah, would uh, I live as my daughter in Jersey, <laughs> my granddaughter <laughs> would uh. <laughs> Lovely. It's called Bo. Bo? Hello. This is the closest I've been up <laughs> to a, a lamb. That's lovely. Yeah. You won't get close to the other ones. No. Oh, mmm. This way. Hello. <laughs> Very nice. The uh, cats here, folks. Brian will like them, my brother, because we used to have a cat called Blackie. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, lovely. Right, this isn't the red lion, folks, at... Uh, at Gloucester, it's not, it looks a bit like the buffet. You now, I'm second at the buffet, but this reminds me I've been to a few buffets and uh, this is what it's like. Uh, this is when we have a reception or something. I've just spotted Alan there <laughs> at the front of the queue. Uh, lovely. So. This has been nice uh, to see. Mm. Mm. Really nice. Mm. It's not McDonald's drive through. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so it's, it's so much like uh, some of the uh, events or do's I've been to when we have the buffet. I'm second. <laughs> in there admittedly but this is what it's like folks follow me been um, fed there it's nice oh. Hello, little one. Are you? Oh. <coughs> hello how are you number five, number five. Hey, yeah, number 12. Well, this is a real bonus being so close up to all the lambs. Yeah, I've had more. Yeah. Ah, just going to do a little pan round. Mm. Yeah. Hi folks, uh, couldn't have met a nicer lady. That was a uh, um, really nice like, tour for the sheep and seeing the horses. Uh, so the buffet, it reminds me, uh, us Edwards is known for 
going to the buffet actually and other people some people they go they won't even eat at a buffet but uh, anyway I've got to head down here and there's a barn and apparently I might see some pigs as well um, so uh, yeah it's brilliant um, I might be able to get a shot of the campsite the lady said as I uh, walk past so I may do that but uh, yeah lovely sunny Sunday morning folks I've got a yeah on my back I don't think you can see it so I'll just put the camera I've got a uh, uh, bottle of water anyway I've just seen uh, I thought it was <laughs> I was thinking of the ex-girlfriends for a sec, but I'm just going to say hello to these cows here. Follow me. Good morning, good evening, or good afternoon. How are you? Yeah, you all right? Lovely. Now, I seem to be scaring them a bit, so I'm not going to... He's a big boy. Want to argue with you, mate? Follow me. Yeah, talking to the lady, and at the front of the site, it's a five van, like CL site. So you can, if you're in one of the clubs, I'm not sure if it's a caravan club or the uh, camping and caravan club, but you can come here, I think, pretty well any time, folks. So if you want a tranquil weekend, this is one of the places to come, folks. Follow me. Yeah, what I'm doing, folks, is when you see the uh, the map for this walk, it shows it starts one end, but uh, apparently where the public footpath ends, it's a private land, a drive, and the chap doesn't like people, you know, going on it. So uh, that's why she sort of put me on the diversion, which was nice of her. So, uh, got some visitors behind me here, folks, so that's nice. How are you? You all right? Yeah? Certainly a strong smell here, folks, so... Uh, <laughs> follow me. Nice to see, though. You all right? Yeah? Yeah, okay. It's insane a lot. Yeah, follow me. They all look really well, uh, healthy animals, I must say. Really nice. <laughs> you all right? Yeah? What the hell's gone wrong with me? I'm talking to cows. What the hell's going on, folks? Follow me. There's some pigs in here, folks. So it's not really on, well, that I've got permission to be here, but I'm not going to go in and disturb them, but uh, they're over there. Yeah, very nice, folks. I hope I'm going to be all right, folks. She said go left of the pigs along this track. So... Uh, Hopefully, yeah. Uh, should be all there. Seem okay. Let's do a quick uh, zoom in. Good evening, good morning, or good afternoon. How are you? Folks, I've just come in to the edge of the woods and the lady from the farm told me there's a little pond here so so it's worth a look folks I oh lovely absolutely lovely these are nice folks as well worth a shot 
Hi folks, uh, obviously I've walked from the caravan site and through the farm uh, down to the pond. I'm now going to join the public footpath. So I'm going to end this video now and then I'll do a part three starting with the walk. And I may add a few more clips into this video from around the farm and the campsite on part two. So I uh, hope you've enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Thumbs up to everybody. It's been a beautiful sunny morning. It's now 29.30. It's great. Uh, absolutely loving it. So uh, that's all for now, folks. So catch you on part three, episode three. Bye for now, folks. Bye. Bye.